again. This is Aguilar Cortez Jr., also known as Lance Danger, and I'm just reading up on some inspiration to continue work on my autobiographical web strip, Nevermind. Um, if you never heard about um, the web strip, Nevermind, it was actually the very first web comic I started publishing online back in the days of forums back in Puerto Rico. And it's basically a web strip that's sometimes funny, sometimes serious, sometimes existentialist. And the only thing you can really expect from that strip is to expect the unexpected, really, since a lot of it is based on my actual life. Another thing that inspired that web strip was Tom Beelan's True Stories, Swear to God, the zines that he had released and published in Puerto Rico which was a slice of his life story as well and later on he turned into a comic book as well titled true story swear to god and that really helped inspire me and gave me the motivation to do this web strip based on my own experiences and it also led me to get the courage to eventually publish other web comics like my main web comic fred peterson the mighty warlord now, I'm reading this format as well because a web strip is pretty much like a newspaper strip. It's like a two to three, four panel gag kind of story. But I'm also thinking of expanding Nevermind a little bit as well and doing an actual graphic novel uh, based in one particular moment in my life. Uh, the one thing I will say is that the title is going to be Bicycle and hopefully it's going to be a very fun read for everyone that decides to give it a chance. Never mind, I have not published a web strip in about three years now, probably four, mainly because after doing five seasons, which is really five separate sets of 12 strips each, I kind of want to give it a bit of a rest to kind of recharge my creative juices for it, recharge those creative batteries for it that particular project and I also wanted to finish other projects that were lingering at the time like the mysterious exorcist one shot the chapter one of Delta task force team six and clown as well clown rogue rogue assassin as well as pick up on Fred Pierce and the mighty warlord which had been mired in hiatus after hiatus and now that I'm at a more comfortable pace updating warlord and now that I've actually finished Chapter 1 of Delta Force, Task Force 6, and as well, Exorcist finished as well, and Clown Rogue Assassin is on its way to continue, I think it was the right time to just pick up and continue on Nevermind as well. These are sometimes kind of rough for me to work on because, as I mentioned before, they are based on personal experiences that's actually happened to me. But in a way, it's kind of therapeutic for me. And it's a good release for my artistic creativity as well, for my artistic voice. And hopefully, if it resonates with you or entertain you, then I feel like that's a job well done for me. Because that's pretty much what I want to do with these things. To just kind of, aside from have this creative outlet and almost more of like a personal outlet, if anyone can find any kind of value in that content, that definitely makes my day and it makes it all worth it.